Students, friends and family all still trying to wrap their heads around the appalling attack yesterday at the University of Texas. Just 24 hours ago, this part of campus near the Gregory Gymnasium was still taped off. Police still processing the area. In the chaos that erupted here yesterday afternoon, four people were stabbed, three of them taken to the hospital. One is still there tonight. But a UT freshman, Harrison Brown, did not survive. While their suspected attacker sits in jail, it's the victim of this tragedy the community is focusing on tonight. The Night Beats' Jason Puckett was able to attend a special mass this evening for the talented musician so many people adored. And Jason, a lot of people showed up tonight to support the grieving family. Well, Quita, that's exactly right. It was a full service at the Catholic Center here tonight. We're standing outside that building just a few blocks from where that attack happened yesterday. But tonight, just a few blocks away, the folks here said they were taking the first steps towards reclaiming their campus and remembering Harrison. Here's a glimpse. Shepherd me, oh God, beyond my wants, beyond. community in pain and grief today in times when we are faced with incomprehensible questions. We know that he was part of our regular worshiping community and that makes him part of us. It's not always important to have the right words to say or to think you can say something that makes it feel better, but sometimes just to be together is healing in itself. And you can see here tonight the tower lit up in honor of Harrison. The entire mass tonight was dedicated to him, and it wasn't just students here tonight, also faculty members and community members. We also want to note that the Catholic Center here on campus has opened a fund for Harrison's family uh, donations. The way to make donations can be found on our website, kvu.com. For now, here live on UT's campus, I'm Jason Puckett, KVU News, Nightbeat.